already. Sasha von der Popius.com, Computex 2010 and the Asus booth. And we have a couple of uh, networks on the EPC line portfolio over here. And we already saw you at uh, back in March. Um, that was my favorite doing CBIT. Actually, it got the Best of Networks Award doing CBIT from me. Um, that's the 1018P, and that's this wonderful built, um, solid aluminum network. Actually, the best EPC I ever had in my hands. And uh, yeah, I can't wait to get this finally uh, in the shops and to finally also buy one. And they changed a little bit the trackpad, by the way, the mouse buttons uh, from the version that we saw on CBIT. That was a pretty early prototype. So we have this kind of riffled uh, surface right now. Besides that, it's all the same. It is still aluminum. It still has this fingerprint scanner over here. Uh, we can switch uh, the webcam on and off. Uh, it has a fantastic keyboard. And yeah, it just feels very, very good. And by the way, USB 3.0. And as you know, that is going to change you know, the transfer rate from an external drive to your internal by, I don't know, a gazillion or whatever. Let's go over to the next one here. Um, that's the EPC 1016P. That is more, let's say, like the entry level of their new, uh, more pricier EPC line. So this one has pretty much the same specs, also Intel Atom N455 or N475. That means a DDR3 report. So the RAM uh, has, oh, there's no DDR3 memory bank in here. Besides that, you know, we still have over here the 1050p and the 1050pd, um, kind of new entry level netbooks. Well, let, let's say not like entry level, not like 1001p that is starting already at 249. So these ones are, should come with, let's say, some 13 hours of battery life. Are using the clamshell, or not the clamshell, of course they are clamshell, but that's a seashell design that Asus introduced uh, last year for the first time. And the same over here, we have a blue version. It's the first time we see this one. I like this matte finish over here, so you don't have a lot of uh, fingerprints on it anymore. And you know what? Actually, that's also a non-glossy display. So, yeah, that's uh, the new seashell line from Asus and the EPC series uh, from the 1080 over the 1060 to the 1050. I'm Sasha for NetworkNews.com. Thanks for watching.